interwebs, how are you doing? I am doing well. I had the craziest day today. I got up, and I got dressed, and I put on my mascara, because that's about all I wear for makeup these days. And I said, wow, I could really use a haircut. I got some mullety things going on. I didn't get a haircut, of course, because that's work and stuff. I went and picked up my sister, and we went to the craft store. I bought almost all the flowers for my wedding. Oh my god. I spent, I was so, they were half off today, so I totally got almost all the flowers. The only thing is I didn't get were the um, flowers for the men's boutonnieres and the flowers for the corsages, because I'm making all my flowers because I am not paying a florist like three or four hundred dollars to do something I just not chapstick over. I'm just not going to do it. Like, plus they die, and like if I make my flowers and they're fake, everybody can keep them, and if you want to put them like in a vase, a vase somewhere, you can, and then it's nice. I finished my invitations, last, so I did that, so I did that, and I also got this footrest. Check it out. I got this footrest. Mm, it's so cute. So I got that footrest, and I got my flowers, and we went to McDonald's, and I got a Happy Meal, and I got this elephant, and his name is Peanut, and um, then we got pizza, and I bought my wedding ring. I know, that's like a crazy thing. I actually bought a set, so I'm going to wear my original engagement ring on this hand and like my new engagement ring on this other, on the, on the proper hand, the left hand. But it had to be resized because I wear a five and a half and they were sevens, so it was just way too big. So I have to wait four to six weeks for resizing, which is lame. But I was really happy with myself because I'm really cheap. Like I said, I, everything for my wedding has been really cheap. Like when I bought my gown, I bought it at a sample store, so it's like an $1,800 gown that I got for $250. And I got my bridesmaids gowns online. They were only like $60 a piece. Not that I paid for those. The bridesmaids paid for those themselves. Then I did, I'm doing my flowers myself. I only paid like $140 for flowers. And I, I got my ring from Walmart, which I know that sounds like so trashy, like, oh, I get a Walmart ring, but it is gorgeous. I can't wait to show it to you guys because it's so pretty. It's, it's, I mean, it's, it's modest. It's three-eighths of a carat, and it was not expensive. It was not expensive at all, but it's crazy because I think it was less expensive than this ring was, and it looks just so bam because of the way the diamonds are cut and placed. It just looks more like, I don't know, it's fancy, and I love it. I'm so excited. It's fun because when you get, you want to get an engagement ring, you don't have to pick it out because you don't know it's coming, I mean, for the most part. Um, but because I picked out a bridal set, so it was a, a wedding ring and an engagement ring that go together, I, I got like an upgrade. But it wasn't really an upgrade because it was cheaper, but still. So I was excited I did that today, even though I can't show you because it's being resized. <sighs> I don't know if you ladies have ever bought rings and had to have them resized, but it's the lamest thing because you're so excited and then you can't, and then you have to wait. Um, I have to do a review on this mouse. Mad Cat sent me this mouse and it's awesome. I've been using it. I changed the color of the lights, see how they're like purple, I changed that. Um, it's a really comfortable mouse, I have to do a review on it, I just haven't done it yet because I'm lazy. It's this mouse, it's the, I'm sorry, I'm so gross. It's the MMO7 rat mouse, I think? Is it just the MMO7, is it not a rat? I should learn things. I don't know. It does all sorts of stuff and it's, it's a fun time. I'm kind of getting a headache. I think I've had too much caffeine today and not enough water, so I'm going to try to rehydrate. And Nick's mom is coming tonight. It's her birthday soon. Her birthday's not yet. It's not for like a week, but I bought her shoes because she loves shoes. So I got her a pair of shoes. We got her a cute card, and I put it in her room. And oh my god, I don't know if I told you guys the guest room fiasco. Oh, I did. I definitely told you I had to get a new bed in there. We have a few more things I want to do before Lita gets here. Lita gets here on the second. I want to paint the room that my cats are in. It's almost finished. I did the hallway, and then I need to paint one part of the guest bedroom, and then I need to put some stuff in there because there's nothing in there. It's just like a bed in a bedroom, and, like, it feels so, like, creepy and empty. So I think I'm going to take some stuff out of here and put it in there, like toys and stuff, just so that it looks lived in. Um, these are my problems. And, yeah, that's, like, it. That's really all the things. I, th I really don't, I don't know that I have anything else to say. Erica took me out for ice cream. That was good. I got vanilla soft serve with strawberries on top. She got strawberry cheesecake ice cream. And this little boy was so cute. He was maybe three. And he like kept like kind of walking over close to me and like smiling at me and then like running away. He thought it was cute. <sighs> I recently got hit on by like an 18 year old kid. And it was like so weird for me because I'm like, I'm old, I'm 26, like I'm not, I'm not into 18 year old kids, sorry, I'm into Nick and Nick only. And he was like, the guy at the pizza place. 
And he was like an 18 year old kid and he was all, ha ha ha. And I was like, because I just, I don't even know how I'm supposed to respond to getting hit on anymore because I'm just not even remotely interested. I don't even, like, I know that, like, a lot of people would say, oh, you should take a compliment or you should find it flattering. But, like, no, I'm really just here to pick up a pizza. Like, I'm not, I'm not, and I'm wearing a ring. Like, I'm not in the market for anything. So, please, please no. Please no, Hitterino. Um, I'm going to go. I hope that you guys are having a great day and a great week and a great life and all those things. I love you all. You're in my heart. So I'll see you soon. Goodbye. Goodbye. The four backwards. Goodbye. 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 Goodbye.